Hi Joy. It's terrible to hear about your son in law's accident. It is uh I think the first thing I needed to talk about is uh insurance. Um just wanted to know was he was his motorbike insurance insured, uh, did he have fully calm or was it uh the what do you call it uh Or the, was it the other side's fault, you know, the accident? But this needs to be sorted out quite uh, soon, really, because um, I think this journey, because I, I know the journey he will have to go through. It's, it's, uh, it's been over four years, this journey, with my wife's accident and... I have been studying a lot about mild brain injury and traumatic brain injury. It sounds as if uh, he's he, he's had a traumatic brain injury, <clears throat> and uh, is the co cognitive intelligence process that starts to depreciate. Uh, and I find basically uh, you need to look at any brain injury may it be a mild brain injury compared to a, a traumatic brain injury where you you know you need to look at it as if like your brains is in a, a can of paint and uh, you've created a small hole in your can of paint and um, basically the the paint is gradually sipping out of the can and this is where rehab comes into it. Um, I think rehab needs to be put into process at a very early stage and able to, to help the patient. You, you find that uh, if caught pretty early and uh, what rehab basically does is it, it removes all the paint out of the can and put it into a new can so because our, our our brains is full of files uh, blank files that um that you know your your body knows that uh that the file is damaged that your all your memories and your short term memories that processing is stored in um it removes it all of that one and puts it into a new can basically so what is interesting, I find, you know, with with insurance companies and um, in America, they're quite far in advance in this area. But at the end of the day, it all boils down to money. You know, they, they, they try they try to save as much money as possible. So you have got to fight basically to obtain uh, the help that is required. And I find it this is this is the most difficult part you know from what I can see of um, even if he has insurance and you find that uh, they will find every way to get out of this uh, to, to, to spend that money that is required on rehab because it's basically a gamble you know the longer it's left the harder it is to 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 to, to well, let's put it this way, you know, the the longer the paint goes on sipping out of the can, there won't be much left in the can to, to transfer it to a new file. And uh, insurance companies are not willing to take that chance because they could spend several years of rehab and uh, not getting anything out of it and having to pay all that money in costs of rehabilitation. So... And you find if you depend on the state to help you that way, and it's, you're back to the same problem again, where the states are not willing to spend that money or invest in that money for something that they don't feel they're going to get any results from. And uh, the main thing is 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 to realize that. Uh, that it's it's something that has got to be done immediately and uh and it's getting the money to 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 be able to set the process rolling you know to get him rehab 
but uh, you find it's, it's, a, it's been a horrible battle in our case trying to get uh, the solicitors to do their job which they you know we've had two solicitors that wasn't prepared to do their jobs and worked against us basically and uh, but I think that's the main thing you need to look into I think as for the accident uh, you'll need to look into you know was there who was to be blamed for the accident and etc you know it's so important that if you can get help through the insurance company that the help is obtained because uh, otherwise it's a I find it's a very long lonely road a, you know a battle like in our case when you think one of the largest companies in the world dropped washing machines at 30 foot on my wife and we we having trouble in getting the treatment that we should do so it just goes to show that the sort of battle you have on to get the society that you belong to in your case if his insurance doesn't cover he's got third party and you know he can't prove that uh it's uh the other person's fault so it's trying to get the uh, you know the I don't believe you'll have a national health system, but to get uh, whatever system you got in place to 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 do work that will cost money, you know, and time on him, which I find our societies don't seem to be working on the level that we hope that they should be working on. I get a lot of um, I've been for years on all websites, but uh, and another thing you can get um, help on. Uh, if you go and join some Google groups such as um, you know that's got to do with brain injury there's one helpful one that I belong to I think it was um, Google group um, what's it called now um, neuro neuroscience area I think it is and um, all these groups that you can belong to and, and in, in Google I believe that if you put it into the brain injuries and whatnot you can get a lot of help uh, I've got tremendous amount of help and uh, knowledge of what it, brain injury is all about which you you know you can obtain and um, but basically so important and all to to is, is it'd be great if you can find out what happened at the accident and um, who was the other party involved what insurance they had and um, same with your son-in-law's motorbike what sort of insurance policy did he have to cover these types of injuries that he's obtained um, but it's it's going to be a, a nasty long road and uh, I think it's so important that if he can obtain some form of rehab and probably this need to be taken on to another area of in Google group where you can uh, communicate on what's happened your situation that you have in the States which is probably totally different from us in the UK but you find they're very reluctant in this area to to put a lot of things like rehab in force and all because it's it's all down to money at the end of the day you know and uh, whether to throw that form of money on rehab that they feel that you you know it might not be worth the money spent that they're not going to get the results and it's all a very um, sensitive area that I find that uh, it's going to be extremely difficult. I need to say this, uh, the first year of my wife's injury she was still very good in uh, remembering things and whatever but uh, over the period two to three to four years now she's she's reached the stage where her short-term memory is virtually gone you know she can't remember things a few minutes later that what is what has been said so so it's the, the essence of it all is to get uh, rehab as soon as possible and uh, in whatever way you can it's basically a battle with uh, 
whatever service you have for this treatment and you need to be pushing them as hard as you can because uh, I, th I think where it comes to brain injuries you got to realize you're, you're playing with time time is the essence and you've got to try to get rehab as soon as possible and um, and you have to fight all the way to to obtain it because uh, the, the this area I think that um, they're not willing to spend the money and and I think even though he even he has insurance and he's getting the the solicitors to to obtain what should be obtained for 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 the patient and it's 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 been it's very very difficult you know and it's but it's the essence of it you find with um with mild brain injury or traumatic brain injuries i think it's it's trying to fight to get some form of rehab for <coughs> for the patient I think in his case it sounds like uh, you know he's, he's he's got a traumatic brain injury which you know being out for six months is a damn long while and um, and I f find that you you know you you need to keep note of his you know he needs to make notes of how his progress is you know, or his depreciation of his ability to you know to keep his cognitive abilities going you know because once you notice there is a depreciation then you know what's happening with that paint basically